Thank you for watching our videos, everyone. We've reached our first milestone of 600 subscribers. Thank you all so very much. The next milestone is 1,000, so please subscribe. Help us get there. And uh, we are so glad that you enjoy watching our videos about expat life in Thailand. So I'm just going down for a swim. And I'll show you the swimming pool here, the communal swimming pool. Um, it's really, really nice. Uh, we don't get to come down to it very much. We should do it more often. There's a bit of a, I don't know whether you can see, there's a bit of a storm in the background there, but we'll see how we go. It's a lovely pool. There's a small gym as well. There's a table tennis table. The pool is actually quite deep, so I have to stand on my tippy toes, unfortunately. There is a little keys pool up in the corner. This is Mishka, she lives down the road and I think she came from Germany. It's very sweet. Hey Mishka. Hey? Well, maybe it was France, I'm not sure, but she travelled a long way. English restaurant, I suppose. I have Thai food as well, called Harry's, on the other side of Wai Hip. They've got an excellent menu. Mike and I have been here before, but everyone else, I don't think, been here before. So uh, we'll see what it's like tonight. Big meal tonight. Big meal for your drinks. Cheers. Cheers. A pint of Leo beer. Caitlin and I are just getting our nails done from DC Nails, Ground Floor at Market Village. All right, these are these are new flavour of chip from Lay's Thailand that you can get at Lotus now. Uh, it was two. Two for one, so we got a couple of them. Um, it's good they have them because usually the only chip flavors you can get here are, um, you know, the fairly ordinary ones and then seafood or seaweed. So um, it's good to have more, I don't know, Western flavors, I guess. So I'll give these a go. There's a good number in there. think they're pretty good they kind of remind me a bit of um 
sour cream and onion a bit, which probably shouldn't be the case, but garlic does come through and a bit of butter, I think. They don't really taste like garlic bread, but they are still really good, I think. Oh, that's good. And what have you bought now, Chris? Well, I've got something a little bit different today. Well, actually, everything I buy is a bit different, isn't it? It is. It's not something we uh, ever come across at home at, back in Australia. So, uh, anyway, look, what I've got is... Uh, let me just get this open. You can, you can see I was well prepared for this video. Okay. So what we have here is just a cloth cover for the water bottle. We've got a water cooler here and the water bottles that sit on top, you've probably got them at your home too, but uh, this is something we haven't seen till we come to Thailand. So here's uh, an example of a water bottle. And then obviously it goes in the water cooler like that. This is empty. And then this just goes over the top. Anyway, I'll put a uh, cut scene in so you can see how, what it looks like on, on, the, uh, on the water bottle. But it just makes it look a bit better, that's all. Okay, now, this is just uh, just showing you the cover for the water bottle. Just uh, reminded me that we should talk to you about the drinking water situation in Thailand. Now, uh, there's no problem getting water from the tap. It's not really safe to drink, right? Just It's similar to any other developing country. Not safe to drink out of the tap. You can do your, clean your teeth, have a shower in the washing machine, in the dishwasher, etc. Uh, it's perfectly fine, but drinking probably not recommended. So uh, what we do and what all Thais do is buy their drinking water and it's very, very cheap. We have a water cooler here, uh, so we get chilled water and uh, we get our drinking water in containers like this. So these are about 19 litres. So there's that style you can get and there's also that style there. They're both about 19 litres. We prefer the clear one because then we can see how much water's left. And uh, they'll cost you delivered round about uh, $1 per bottle of 19 litres of uh, clean drinking water. And uh, then we use the the ordinary 1.5 litre bottles for our cooking, when we're cooking rice or uh, boiling some pasta or something, we'll just use the water out of the 1.5 litre or six litre bottles. We don't generally use those because they're in the water cooler. And they weigh a ton. Yeah, they weigh a ton, they're, they're really heavy. And uh, uh, the, one of the things with the cover is these water bottles, they, in the factory, they just run around on the concrete and this gets kind of knocked up and a little bit grubby looking. So it's not that pleasant when you're sitting them on the water cooler, if you can just imagine, sitting them on the water cooler and then you're looking at that when you're getting yourself a nice clean glass of water and you think, <laughs> oh, you know, is the water okay? Well, it is okay. So we, uh, so this one is, this one's pretty good, but it is dirty, right? So it's just not really pleasant to look at. So the, hence the cover helps with that as well. They and just, they recycle those bottles. Yeah, they're they? all recycled. They wash inside, but the, the outside, uh, not, so, <laughs> not so much. But the water inside is fine and they uh, wash the neck of the bottle. And uh, then when you get the next uh, load of water, they take the old bottles away, obviously. So there we go, that's the water situation. And your water bill for the water that comes through the tap is very, very cheap. It costs about, uh, around for a family like us of four people, it costs around $4, $4 a month, four or $5 a month. Um, and that's watering the lawn and so on. If you've got a pool, you'll, spend more but it's only four or five dollars a month for water for the out of the tap it runs a toilet and the shower and everything and these these are about round about a dollar for each one so it's very very cheap and it's certainly compared to australia where we come from the amount of money that we pay for drinking water is, is this is just minuscule compared to that